Oh, look, everybody. Only this time we have uh, more than one checkpoint to collect at once. Don't have to follow a route. Well, not yet, anyway. I'm pretty sure that later on, once you've collected this first set of checkpoints, you'll then have to follow a route. Uh, oh, hell. Silly me. Silly me. Oh, come on. Can't afford to make silly mistakes like that. Right, how do you get to that next one? Uh, oh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Right. In that case, I guess I'll go for that checkpoint first. But I'll collect this one on the way. Or try to. Okay. Oh, that's not a checkpoint, that's a shotgun. It's just force of habit. I'm so accustomed to seeing uh, glowing halos that I'm mistaking a lot of things for checkpoints right here. <laughs> Around the back. Oh. Now then. Now we follow our route. Some pisshead messing around. I'll bust your wise ass toy. So it looks like uh, when we get to each floor, we have a set of checkpoints to collect. And we move on to the next floor. You better hurry, you've only got 10 seconds left, as of now. The next one is... there. Thank god the timer went away. Um, oh. The... Come back! <laughs> yeah, if there was a time limit at this point, I would have lost for sure. Oh, bloody shit. Right, come on. That shut the clock up for now. Hmm, I said for now. Oh. Look, I know I've got drunk cam, but there's no excuse to not collect that checkpoint. I'm staring you full in the face. Right. Oh. Right. Around the corners. Oh, the final chair. Oh, shit. Don't fall off. Thank God there's no time limit for the last checkpoint. So, I'm drunk and I've got to collect a checkpoint which is on a very, very narrow beam. Can I do it? Of course, because there's no time limit anymore. Easy. I'm going to save again. Well, the cooldown period for uh, the save option must be quite short. Suits me. Right, we are now driving a Patriot around the golf course. And there are how many checkpoints to collect? Let's see. 25. Oh. 
one in the water. Water hazard. Honk. I'll get across the bridge as well. Might as well. Ooh, another police bribe in the water. That's a very, uh, oh! Can I actually get out of that? I might be able to, but the real question is, can I still complete the side mission in time? Once that left, back left wheel touches the ground. Okay. I'll be very lucky if I manage to uh, complete this side mission in time. I have a feeling I might not be able to. I lost a lot of time trying to get out of that. Keep going, keep going. Come on, bushes and trees, get out of the way so I can see. Just over three minutes left. Yeah, I was going to say that's a very generous time limit, but I think I've uh, wasted too much. Come on. Next one is on the... I'll just call it Lombard Street. I think in San Fierro. In San Andreas, that road is called Windy, 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 Windy Street, or something like that, anyway. Right, where's the entrance to the tennis court? I'm not. S oh, here it is. Gotcha. Bloody net. Okay. And the other entrance is over here. Ten more, I've got just over two minutes in which to get them. Go for the one over here. First of all, without flipping myself upside down, which I very nearly did. Holy shit. Incoming Patriot. Right, past the bunkers. Past the driving range. Who is this guy? Boys, deal with him. Go beat eight tons of crap out of him. Here now, I got you a membership. I was only slowing down to avoid driving straight off into the water. Fuck, speaking of water, there's a checkpoint under the bridge. Isn't, isn't there? Yes, but not that part of the bridge. Okay, easy. Easy. Go. 60 seconds. I'm pretty sure I've made it. Uh, are you sure? Not yet, to be honest with you. Right. Mind the bunkers and the caddies and the flag. And most of all, the water. Oh. Right, hurry up. That last checkpoint's on the other side. Fuck. Please don't screw this up now. Go away, Cardi. With 10 seconds remaining, I did it. Despite the minor setback. Very well played. Right. Number 
number six. Welcome back to Fort Baxter Air Base. Yeah, I was right. The soldiers that normally patrol the army base area in this mod have been replaced with the sharks. And yes, you read that correctly. 65 checkpoints. Wow. We're breaking into a military base and I'm drunk. What could be more stupid? Louise! Yeehaw! Suck on that! I think it's quite fitting that the sharks have replaced the soldiers in this mod, because I'm sure I read somewhere that in the main game, um, if you kill enough soldiers at the army base, um, your least favourite gang will be listed as the sharks or street wannabes in the stats menu. I know they're not called the sharks in this game, but they are in Vice City Stories. But sharks is a lot easier to say than street wannabes at the end of the day. Oh! Hey you. Hey you. Five, four, three, two, good. At least I'm not timed at this bit. Uh, no. I don't recommend trying to drive a bike up a vertical wall. Unless, of course, your bike is like uh, Spider-Man. How are you supposed to get that? <laughs> Excuse me, right. Bingo. Right. If need be, I'll uh, go through the gate to reach this checkpoint instead. But this might be enough, actually. And it was, ow. And Tommy proceeds to bump his nose on every single one of those bars on the way down. Sorry, I'm just trying to get my bearings over the fence. Cool. That's not good, actually. I hope my bike has pot-proof tyres. I think it's safe to say that a uh, helicopter didn't spawn correctly. I've just noticed the uh, speed bar. I take it when that runs out, mission failed. Those sharks are still shooting at me. Okay. Timer and speed bar have both gone. Good. Isn't that... Isn't this hangar usually locked in the main game? I'm not sure. Uh, oh. Nice close proximity. Right, surely I've gone far enough away from those sharks to make them despawn. Right, on the roof, using the supports. Here we go. What colour is this chip? Yeah, I thought it might be red. Right, where's the next checkpoint? Right there. Make a beeline for it. Uh, the thing about these checkpoints is the radar doesn't show you where the next one is. Unlike uh, most other ones. Thank god there wasn't a ship box between those uh, wooden posts, otherwise it would have been potentially fucked. 
and the timer just fucked off. Not for long. Right. Behind the tent. Keep going. You guys feeling dizzy yet? Don't worry, this is GTA, not Cloverfield. Right, I think I've been recording for almost two hours now. I'll see if I can squeeze in one more checkpoint side mission. And this is that NOE style checkpoint challenge I told you about a while ago. So we have to uh, stay below radar limit. Otherwise, you get chased by hydras. No, just kidding, just kidding. Mission failed. And you hear a beeping noise when you, when the radar meter starts filling up. And I'm assuming it's uh, the unused low fuel sound effect. And even though I don't drive, um, I'm sure that's um, a noise that you would hear if uh, your car is running low on fuel. Oh dear. Fuck it. Fuck it. You can afford to take your time. Because unlike the other checkpoint challenges, I am not timed. Oh, there goes my neck again. Just take your time. You've got all the time in the world. But just stay low and you'll be fine. <laughs> so it's similar to not just NOE from San Andreas, but also Dildo Dodo from the main game. God, what a name for a mission title. And the Lost and Damned, you've also got The Shit's Cursed. I noticed that um, on uh, Xbox, if one of your friends is playing that mission, um, then when you go to look at his or her profile on your friends list, instead of saying, this shit's cursed, it says, this stuff's cursed. I bet that's the same on PS3 as well. Oh, you took your time building. Come on, wing. That's mental. Get down. Get down, ship. Down, 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 down. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Hopefully I can take off after I get past this bridge. Thank God this is a seaplane and not a dodo. Right, come on, take off. Where's the checkpoint? Right there. Okay. Turn carefully because there could be a building right in your face. But thankfully, no. As you can see, this mission is not as easy as it looks. Thank you, wing. And right, get down. Checkpoint over there. Gotta scratch my nose, hold on. Itched, right. Fuck off, nose itch. I remember during a lot of my previous GTA playthroughs, it would be my ear 
that would be itchy. Yeah, itchy ear syndrome. I'll be honest, I've not had that in a long time. Maybe the fact that I now wear earplugs for sleeping has something to do with it. But why would it? I don't know. It's just one of life's mysteries, I suppose. The human body is a very strange and fragile creation. Oh, yeah, I need to take off again. Don't mind the buildings, Mr. Bean. Get down. Oh, I mind the ground as well. Remember, it's a sea plane, not a ground plane. 11 checkpoints remaining. Turn, turn, turn. Oh, oh dear. Oh shit. Oh shit. Hello? Right, hold on. Right. What do I do now? Right, I need to make my way back to the ocean, obviously. Without wrecking the plane. Careful. The hitboxes, as in shit boxes on these pillars and lamp posts, is probably. are probably larger than you think. Fuck it, I've had enough. I've had enough. Just restart. I'll have one more go at it. What a load of crap. Right, now we're back on track. As you can see, I just uh, gave up with trying to get the seaplane back into the air during the previous attempt. I was wanting to... Oh, for fuck's sake! What the bloody fuck? Right, last try, and if I fail this attempt... Ju fail during this attempt, I'm just going to come off. Right, I'm going to do it this time, okay? Yeah, this time I'm going to do it. I almost didn't, you know. <laughs> Man, where the hell is it? Up there, bloody hell. Right, stay nice and low. Radar bar is at zero. For now. And the next checkpoint is a wee bit... 
I'd say southwest of the next one. So I'll climb up. Once I'm above that building, the radar should stop going up. That's it. Drop. How many more checkpoints? Five. Okay. Game, please don't crash. I can't be arsed in this challenge again. Ping, ping. And the final checkpoint for once is blue. Not red. Fucking finally. Anyway folks, that wraps up this recording session. Hope you enjoyed, thanks for watching. Stay solid and whatever you do, for the love of God, please don't let the dodo, or in this case, <laughs> the seaplane bite. Until next time, take care and good night in the next uh, recording session. I will defend my asset. After that, I'm not so sure. We'll cross the bridge when we get to it. Oh, look at that. What are the chances of that happening? Oh. Fuck it, it'll do. Adios, amigo. Yep, yet another extra recording session. So I've got uh, three safe houses left to buy in this mod, and I'm 99% sure that I know which ones they are. One is one of those uh, sea huts just south of Ocean Beach. One is on Starfish Island, and one is the Moist Palms Hotel in downtown. Now I know um, I lost control of Sunshine Autos during the previous session. I'll uh, get it back later. Because uh, during a practice run... Hold on a minute, I'll explain things once I've uh, got my boat. Perfect. Well, I don't want to get in the Rio. Fuck off, Rio. Oh, it's a speeder now, is it? Because uh, during practice runs, whenever I uh, rented a boat, it was a Predator. Interesting. Which asset now, by the way? The ice cream factory again, okay. Yeah, during um, a practice run, I was uh, curious to see what would happen if I uh, took out a bank loan and didn't pay it back. And while I was uh, waiting to see what would happen, another asset was attacked. And as you can see, it's just happened again. So I think I will uh, defend the asset which has just come under attack and I'll get Sunshine Autos back some other time, okay? I think I did the right thing by uh, renting a boat. So my next stop is Starfish, and I'll buy the safe house there next. And then the one in downtown. And then once all three safe houses are bought, I will save, defend the ice cream factory. And you know what? I'll get the car showroom back in this session as well. Yeah, go on.
Not gonna lie, that was a bloody good shot. <laughs> Better than my shots. Everybody knows that. Quack. Stand up, please. Come on, officer, I did you a favour. I hope I'm going to be able to uh, buy this uh, safe house with the unwanted level. Ugh, I don't see why not, to be honest with you. Besides, there's a cop bribe right there. By the way, you might be able to hear um, a baby crying in the background. My upstairs neighbours recently had a baby. Many congrats. Yes, mod or game, whatever, I know it's been attacked. I think by now the world and his fucking wife knows. Yeah, sometimes when I drive past that uh, pier, I keep thinking I've seen a loot box or something. Something down there must be a similar colour to a loot box. Here we have the 15th and final safe house. Or property, whatever. Crick of the neck, once again. Don't worry about it. As long as I'm not in pain, which I'm not, I'll be fine. When a joint cracks or clicks, it's just uh, a bubble of gas forming in the joint and then popping. That's all it is. I'm going to use my phone to save right here. I've made a backup once again. I always do. Yeah, ever since I had that issue with uh, Bandicam during my uh, six stars playthrough this game, I've uh, started making backup saves. But now I use Fraps, and uh, so far I've not had any issues with uh, Fraps crashing, unlike Bandicam. I don't have any many uh, issues with the uh, lag when using fraps either. Again, unlike Bandicam. It's a shame you can't get in a vehicle to do uh, drive-bys during asset wars. And the reason you can't is because you have to be on foot while defending or attacking an asset. So I'm 99% sure that is the case. You gotta love the shotgun's uh, widespread of pellets. Especially from the Spaz shotgun, which uh, it's almost always a one-hit kill. Ow. Right, that's enough Spaz shotgun for this asset war. Right, now I can back off a bit. Keep forgetting I've got a chainsaw. Use it. One guy left on the chopper, of course. Uh, 
Mr. Versace, what are you staring at? I wonder sometimes. Right. Yes, freeway, mine, if you don't mind. Right, let's see if I can refill my uh, shotgun ammo by getting in these cop cars. If I can't, I'll uh, see an arms dealer. Is the donut shop twat there? Nope. Well, remember, you can quite easily refill your health by going to a safe house. And that is exactly what I'll do. Sunshine Autos, I'm coming. Got Twenty shotgun runs. I'm still to uh, get my. Rocket launcher ammo back from the heavy weapons arms dealer. To be honest with you, I might just keep the M60. Because there are no more uh, combat missions in the game, apart from the asset wars right here, of course. So I think from this moment on, or should I say from this point, I mean at this point in the mod, all of my targets are human targets, not vehicles. I'm not the biggest fan of uh, fighting human targets with a rocket launcher, because the chances of a rocket getting shot out of the sky are very high. Right. Chainsaw time and God mode time. I'm over halfway done now. Awesome. back and be chopped to pieces. Like standing timber. Oh. We're almost done everybody, I promise. There we go. See if I can kill all of them before my pill runs out. Yep. Oh god, was that van alright? Right, back to a safe house. Order equipment. Withdraw the cash. Save and end the recording session. Hope you enjoyed, thanks for watching, stay solid and don't let the asset wars bite. Until next time, take care and good night. I guess I'm ordering equipment next time. Never mind. Oh fuck. Just withdraw already. <laughs>